Good morning, Cougar Nation. I'm Jordan. And I'm Michael. And here are your school announcements for Friday, October 26th. Have you bought a candy gram for your boo yet? Today is the last day yearbook will be selling friendly ghost candy grams for $1. Caramel apple lollipops and messages will be delivered on Halloween. Don't be left out. Find a yearbook member today. It's trunk or treat time. We need candy and cars. Please message Miss Sinka or stop by room 103 if you're interested in helping with trunk or treat on Sunday, October 28th, 1 to 3 p.m. Central Time. Anyone helping out with trunk or treat on Sunday should be here at 12 school time and park where the buses normally park. Trunk or treaters will be parking in the small parking lot near the central office. The NPHS Ban Haunted Trail event is taking place this Sunday, October 28th from 5 to 9 p.m. at the NPHS Cross Country Course. The cost is $5 adults and $3 students admission. $1 off if you bring in a canned food item. The trail only takes 20 to 25 minutes and is a great way to top off the afternoon spent at Trunk or Treat and the International National Honor Society events that day. Sign, signs will be posted from the Horseshoe parking lot to lead people back to the starting point of the trail by the bridge behind the bus garage. There will be lots of free candy and fun mini, mini games to play after the trail as well for students of all ages. Students, start planning your costume for school on October 31st. Donate $1 to get a sticker to wear a costume during the day. All proceeds will go to the food bank. Costumes must be school appropriate and no mask are allowed. Pre-order your yearbook before November 5th to take advantage of the early bird discount. After this date, the price will be increased from $55 to $60. Don't delay. Bring cash or check to Mrs. Barden or Mr. Jones or reserve yours at yearbookforever.com. Seniors, you will have until March to send Ms. Barden the senior picture you want in the yearbook. If you do not send one in, your school picture will be used. Make sure to send the pictures as a JPEG. The New Prairie Marching Band Cougars are going to semi-state for the first time in years. It will be held at, high, at Pike High School. The band will be performing at 4 p.m. Come out and cheer them on for this historic event. And now for sports. It's going to be an exciting weekend for New Prairie sports, and, then, and Cougar Nation has a lot to cheer on. Many of our teams are in playoff action around the state. Jagu Corbett is representing New Prairie Cross Country tomorrow, racing in the state meet in Terre Haute at the Laverne Gibson Championship Cross Country Course. The race starts at 1245 Central Time. Good luck, Jacob. The Lady Cougar Volleyball team plays in the IHSA semi-state round versus Newcastle High School at Huntington North High School on Saturday. The game begins at 12 p.m. Central. The Cougar football team travels to Father Bly Field to take on St. Joseph High School in the second round of the IHSAA sectional playoffs. Tickets will be on sale until noon today in the athletic office for $6. Come to support our teams and your fellow student athletes throughout the weekend. Go. Lunches for today include mini corn dogs, macaroni and cheese or, or with a breadstick, PB&J combo with a cheese stick, Asian chicken salad with bread and vegetables, buttered carrots, garden salad, fruit, fruit fresh, and fruit juice. Breakfast tomorrow is French toast bites, uh, cereal with a choice of granola bar, and fruit, uh, fruit juice, and fresh fruit. Big shout out to Miss Leiter for letting us use her room for announcements. Thank you so much. I'm Michael Kamak. And I'm Jordan Quadrado, and that's your news for Friday, October 26th.